one piece of shit. If he spent one legal day on his life, it'll be a record. Now this is it for you. Suspension, review board, you've had it. The soldiers will get around you protecting a car rather than the other car. God damn it. I'm gonna tell you something about this man. He's got more brains than you ever know. He's got more guts than any partner I ever had. But just cause you say it with conviction, it don't mean shit to me. Let's get out of here. And why the Christ do you think you're going? Don't you think you're being kind of hard on the guy? You go fuck yourself, convict! Special Agent Utah. This is not some job flipping burgers at the local drive-in. Yes, the surfboard bothers me. Yes, your approach to this whole goddamn case bothers me. And yes, you bother me! And Pappas, oh, for the love of Christ, just how the hell did I ever even let you talk me into this whole boneheaded idea to begin with? Harp, we're working undercover. It takes time. We produced a few... No, 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 no! Let me tell you what you've produced. Over the last two weeks, you two have produced exactly squat! Squat! During which time, the ex-presidents have robbed two more banks! Now, for Christ's sake, does either one of you have anything even remotely interesting to tell me? Caught my first tube this morning, sir. God damn it! Uh, why do you leave that thing in a car? It sticks out so I can't lock it. I am not listening to I you. I really hate when you do that. Then stop then, all right? It's childish. Is that That's fucking Foley in here? All right, there's Todd. It's showtime, OK? Hey, boss, I know what you're going to say, but you I'm... You mind telling me where the fuck you come off going undercover without authorization from me? What the fuck is this all about? You want to play some fucking bullshit cowboy cop? Go do it in somebody else's precinct. Don't you want to hear my side of the story? What's your fucking side of the story? Let's hear your side of the story. Hey, Axel. I'm not taking any more of this shit from you. Do you know how much this little stunt of yours is going to cost this city? I don't think cost is the issue here, sir. I think the issue should be my blatant disregard for proper procedure. You damn right, wise ass. The mayor called the chief, the chief called the deputy chief, the deputy chief just chewed my ass out. You see, I don't have any bit of it left, don't you? When the fuck did you get a truckload of cigarettes from anyway? From the Dearborn hijack. From the Dearborn hijack? That fucking bus went down last week. That truck is supposed to be in the damn pound. I'm trying to tell you. Jeffrey, this is none of your fucking business. This is not my locker. Listen, Axel. No more of these setups, you understand? You're a good cop. And you got great potential, but you don't know every fucking thing. And I'm tired of taking the heat for your ass. One more time, you're out on the street. Do you understand me? Look, boss, let me tell you. Do you understand me? Yeah, I understand. Boss. The chief ain't true at all out. You still got a little ass there. Don't fuck with me, Axel. Not now. Go on. Go home. Later! I got the city council chewing my eggs off for the plane you crashed. I got the mayor scheduled for raids up my Lincoln Tunnel for that stunt you put on the beach. Now everybody want to know where it is, where it is, and where we will be. Do I make myself clear? Just doing my job. You giving this department the worst reputation in the country. Watch yourself. Oh, what did I say? Did you hear what I said? I heard what I said because I was standing there when I said it. I told you. I told you to secure a witness, not to shoot up a neighborhood, not to do another dead body. Just get the dope back and do it quietly. Look, Captain. This whole situation is getting out of control. You're goddamn right it's getting out of control. But look, man, I damn near had to pass a pop quiz before she believed I was him. Going, going, yes. A little off. I haven't killed anybody yet today, Captain. Hey, do you want me to yell at you? Because I can do that. Let me tell you something. This witness, it's the only good news I got, OK? The only good news. You guys are bad news. So what does that mean? That means if you have to be Mike Lowry, Santa Claus, Effie Hutton, I don't give a shit, that's what you're gonna be. Whoa, 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 wait, wait a minute. What, what the hell is going on in here? I was like getting them all in before you showed up. Can somebody talk to me, please? Can I know what's going on? Cap, these fools could have gotten a look at my license plate last night. 
So where's the girl now? His place. What? You left her by herself? Our only fucking witness? You left a strange hooker alone in my apartment? The girl is not a hooker, as far as I know. Gee, I had to stash her somewhere. Her and her dogs, Luke and Dookie. So you left dogs in my house? So there's dogs and a hooker in my house. Hey, man, listen, how I about just, you just I... add some chimps, okay? We can have a carnival. Man, did I just you say respect you my stuff, no please? Hooker. Can you please? Hey, you don't respect me. Shut up! For years, Sinclair has been up my ass trying to pin something on me. Well, I'm always taking it for you, right? Do it for me. Now, if we get this witness to ID the shooters, maybe we catch our bad guys. But until then, until then, you are Mike Lowry. You be him. That's what you are. You're him. Yeah, You're I... him. I don't want to hear it. You're him. And you, you, you are you. You be you, but not in front of her. You're him. You're you. Ah. I don't think York was a suicide. She was on to something. Oh, something is more like it. You know, those wilderness girls cooking with lace with cocaine. No wonder I couldn't eat just one. York left me a message. She'd uncovered a drug running operation. I think that's what got her killed. You don't think it was the bullets? Give me the case. Your days from retirement. Let it go. Let it go? York was a partner, a friend. I owe her. I owe it to every cop who's ever walked a beat. Every cop who's ever made a bust, who's ever laid his life on the line. Wait a minute. I'm the captain here. I do all the yelling. But if it's that important to you, take the damn case. Thank you. Thank you, Captain. Don't be so fast to thank me on this, Luca, because you're going to be naked on this one. It's on the line for you. People are going to be watching. Now, you blow it, you're going down. You screw up, you're going to be hung out to dry. You drop the ball, you're going to be left twisted in the wind. If you embarrass this department, your pants will be dancing with figs. Is that clear? Everything but the pants fig thing. Inspector T, how you doing? Where the fuck you been, Foley? And what the fuck is this? It's a uh, blue slip. What in the hell do you need a thousand dollars for? A little flash money. Or... Flash money? Well, let's see here. Two thousand dollars for a suit. Two hundred dollars for a tie. A requisition order for a Ferrari. I don't want to see any more of these blue slips. When am I going to see some arrest slips? I know that you're getting upset, and I know that you have reason to be upset. But let me tell you something, Chief. I am close. I'm so close now, I'm closer than I've been, and it's, it's making me crazy, because I can smell it. It's in the air, and I smell it. It's, I sm Do you smell it? Because I smell it. All I smell is your bullshit. For six months, I've been pouring money down a bottomless hole. Where the bad guys at the end of this rainbow? Wait a second. Look, I just thought that if there was a problem... Don't think, Axel! It makes my dick itch! The truth is, this apartment has fronted you a fortune. And my ass is on the line. I okayed all this shit. I'm out of my fucking mind to keep letting you talk me into this shit. But I can't pull out till I get some kind of bust or my career is finished. But I promise you, I won't go down alone. I'm going to give you three days. If I don't see some results by then, I'm going to cover my own ass. How do you like that arrangement? 